Here's a tutorial in how to make uh, frosted boxes. You know when you go to the magazine and you would see there's a transparent, uh, semi-transparent white box and then there's text underneath uh, over on top of it. Uh, I'll just give you an idea so that you know, would know what I'm talking about. So first what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a box. So for example, I'll put my text in here. Now, the box should be in front of this image here. Okay. So put the box and then make it white. Okay. And to make a rounded corners in the box, you go to your shape tool or F10. And you see these four squares here. You just drag it to the right. And there you go. What I'm going to do, I'm going to remove the outline first. So go to your outline tool and then click on X. So no outline. Now as you can see, the box here is opaque. It's not transparent. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to make it trans semi-transparent. So I'll go to my interactive transparency tool. Okay, You can get it from 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. It's the icon from down interactive transparency tool. Now when you activate the interactive transparency transparency tool you'll have some options here. So right now there's none. So what I'm going to do I'm going to uniform. So I'm going to make a uniform fade in this box. There. Okay. Okay, the default for uniform is 50. So what I'm going to do I'm going to increase the the opacity of it. Sorry, that's decreasing. If you go down to the uh, to the left side, it's increasing the opacity. Opacity. Okay. So now here, I'll just zoom out here. So hit F4 to zoom out. Very good. So I've got a box with frosted effect. Okay. So what I'm going to do? I'm going to the internet. I'm just going to. Uh, cut and paste some text so copy okay, and then I'll go back here now since I'm doing a paragraph text I'll click on my text tool or F8 and then create a box inside and then I'll paste edit paste okay. if I want to enlarge the text in the paragraph text I'll just go here and I'll say 14 points let's go 16 points here and I'll just adjust the the box okay now if you take a look now we got a frosted because that's why we're gonna put a frosted one so that people could still read the text just imagine if we don't have this one it's so hard right so I'll just undo it there. Now if you want to make make it fancy, then you can just always go click on the box and then put an outline. Okay, outline tool or F12. And I'll put a thicker outline, say four points, and then I'll make a different color, say uh, I'll just make it always, I'll say green, and then click click OK. There you have it. If I zoom out, there you go. So it's nice and clean. That's all for this tutorial.